SBF, Sam Bagman Freed, basically was named the most generous billionaire of his time. And his time was short. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's definitely a short. Yeah, that's definitely a <laughs> short. Um, anyway, uh, guys, it's uh, we're going to go. We're gonna go to the main part of the show. We showed you basically those two clips for you to, so you could have an insight in who Sam is and what his goal is. So you can see here he was on the cover of Forbes as one of the youngest billionaires ever at age 29. He had a quite fast rise to, to the billion. RJ, do you know who also was on the cover of the Forbes? Who also had a pretty fast rise but plunged to the ground let me guess you just need to give me one hint does this person i'll give you one hint give me a second <laughs> let me think Not, not, not drugs. Not drugs. It was a startup. It was a startup. Was it a female? Very warm. <laughs> Does his first name start with E? Her, her first name. Yeah, 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 yeah. Does her last name start with H and ends with Ohms? <laughs> you should have asked, is she pregnant? <laughs> is she pregnant? Elizabeth Holmes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Where's that? <laughs> yeah, we should, we should get an applause for that. We should get an applause for that. <laughs> Elizabeth Holmes. Yeah. Elizabeth Holmes was sentenced yesterday to 11 years for her part of fraud um, with her um, startup Theranos, where she basically defrauded investors and uh, claimed her uh, solution for, uh, it was, I think, that's something to do with blood. That's why I did the right. thing. But uh, anyway, it wasn't working, but she continued perpetrating the fraud with her uh, startup and then uh, it suddenly collapsed just like FTX uh, e even though FTX had different reasons why it collapsed by the way did you, did you know that she's pregnant right now no from you from the remark you made I I know but she I is. didn't know before no I didn't know before well, what a what a struggle <laughs> life is that born yeah. born in the in the penitentiary <laughs> born here. in the system <laughs> <laughs> yeah uh, let's yeah. not laugh about it well yeah. the kid well, is the... well do you know that sometimes uh, or oftentimes the in criminal cases so mm -hmm. you have two things right you can Either the person, whether the person is guilty or not, that's the first step. Mm -hmm. And if that person is guilty, then the second question would be, of course, there are more criteria. I'm shortening it. But the second question, question would be, what should the punishment be? And with regards to the punishment, the judge not only looks at the maximum that is stated in the law, but also the personal circumstances. And mm. oftentimes women would, will use the fact that they have children as a reason to 
at least minimize their punishment. So they Exposure. would say, yeah, yeah. And, but then a common reaction of judges would be, yeah, but you knew that beforehand. Now, in this case, I don't know. Does he have other, ch other children? I don't know. No, but this is the first. Yeah. So it is. It is practicing during the trial. It is right. pretty convenient. You might, have, you might have tried to pull that one. <laughs> you might have tried, uh, what you're describing, she you might wanted to try to pull that. Yeah, maybe. maybe but it's not. Maybe it's has not, worked. Maybe. But, but um, all jokes aside, the it's it's it, it is a shame for the child you know yes, to definitely. to be born in a situation like that it's it's not optimal at all it's not no you don't wish that on anyone i don't know how old she is but also probably the time uh, well anyway yeah let's not discuss that um yeah. <laughs> but it, that's uh so both people were on forbes so if i end up on forbes guys pray for me if you end up on force, I might need to distance myself from you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, Sam Bank Fried or Freed officially SBF SB SBF just like AOC. Hey, but you can't. Uh, that's a pretty. That's a pretty interesting name to have. <laughs> and you're in banking. And you're in banking and in the financial sector, right? <laughs> and he fried that bank and he up. Fried, he fried it up. Yeah. He fried it up. So, yeah. so Sam basically founded FTX. First, he founded Alameda Research, which is, uh, uh, I think, uh, Nas Nas Daily also said he he was trading uh, uh, in Japan and America, basically doing. Uh, what is called the uh, arbitrage trading, where you buy basically high at one marketplace and sell, so s buy low at one marketplace and sell high at the other. Um, that also happened in the past in Japan, which I will talk about later. That was the first big um, crypto scandal. This is like, I think, the third or the fourth in, by, by now. But this is definitely the biggest one. Basically, he started Alameda Research first which, as a trading company and was making a lot of money with that. And then he started FTX, which is a trading currency exchange, trading for trading currencies, cryptocurrencies, and basically investment. At, at least that's how they, they marketed it, for all kinds of investment. From if you want to buy, invest in chicken, and then at the... I can recall the, the, he said something very weird in his um, in his presentation. It wasn't chicken. It was, I think, I can recall. Anyway, he he wanted to make it basically a exchange for not only crypto but much more. 